Hi everyone, I am so happy to be sharing story time with the author Calm Ninja with you today. And I have something really amazing to share with you. Um, let me get off this virtual background so you can see more clearly. Okay, so these just came in. This has been the most requested item that I have been receiving for a very long time and they are box sets. So um, we have three of three box sets. So we have the emotions and feelings box set and the growth mindset and the leadership. So Calm Ninja is in the leadership box set. She, he's right here. And these are all the books that are in the box set. Here's the back of the book. So you can collect all four and you would have 32 ninja books. And here's what the top of them looks like. See all the ninjas. Um, these are available for pre-order. And right now on my website, ninjalifehacks.tv. And this is, these are actually a little bit better quality than what you're getting right now. Um, on Amazon, just a tiny bit. So I would love to know what you think of them. So let's get started with the story of Calm Ninja. One of my personal favorites. Do you already do yoga? This book belongs to the Nins. And there is Calm Ninja doing yoga. Calm Ninja earned his, the nickname Coolio because he was as cool as a cucumber. And that's because no matter the circumstance, Calm Ninja could stay very calm. So here he is eating ice cream and he has bees around him. Do you think you could stay that calm? For example, when Calm Ninja found out his brother ate his candy without asking, he would simply say, you can have all my pink. When learning how to play a new instrument, he remarked, okay, this might take a while. And if he was getting yelled at, he would answer, answer, all right, mom, I'll try it like that next time. Calm Ninja was very calm, but there was a time he really could get quite impatient. While learning basketball, he would get stressed and scream, this is too hard. During violin practice, he would become frustrated and shout, this violin is not working. While doing schoolwork, he would get anxious and say, what if I can't finish this? One day, his friend Grateful Ninja introduced him to a strategy to help him feel calmer. I know you've been feeling stressed out. There's something I do daily that helps me take in life's challenges better. It slows down my breathing so I can make better decisions throughout the day. What is it? asked Calm Ninja. Okay, I'll let you in on my secret. It's called the Ninja Yoga Flow, replies Grateful Ninja. Do you want to try it? Sure, let's do it together. The Ninja Yoga Flow. Okay, I don't mind if you get up and do some of these poses while I'm reading them. I can stand tall like a mountain. I can bend like a cat. Can you bend like a cat? 
When I exhale, I can moo like a cow. Here's my downward dog. I can slither like a cobra. I am brave like a warrior. I am strong like a boat. I am as powerful as a lion. Now I am a bridge. Here's my moon. That one actually is harder than it looks. <laughs> my plank helps my back and stomach. I can get in my child's pose. How do you feel? Thanks, I like it. Yoga makes me feel calm. The most important thing about yoga and remaining calm is remembering to breathe. It's something you can do even when you don't have a lot of time, like this. Inhale for three seconds, hold for three seconds, and exhale for three seconds. Now you try it. The next day, Calm Ninja had several things to do and he began to panic. Suddenly, he remembered something. He decided to practice the yoga and breathing exercises he learned. And do you know what happened? That's right, Calm Ninja remained calm the entire day and every day thereafter. He was soon known as the calmest ninja of all. Your calm mind is the ultimate weapon against life's challenges. The end. And there you have it. That was Calm Ninja. I hope you enjoyed this story time with the author, Calm Ninja, and I would love to see you in your yoga poses, snap me some pics and send them to me. I love hearing from my readers and I will see you next time. Bye.